Hi everyone, in this video we will be reviewing open source search technologies, Elasticsearch and Solar. What I will be going over is the implementation, cluster management, search functionality and end user analytics. Hopefully, this will help you make an informed decision when you have to choose the right search technology for your project. Let's start with the implementation process of the two technologies. Recent changes to Solar have made the implementation much more manageable. You can grow and shrink clusters, create indices and more. Configuring search still needs a managed schema file to define index structure, fields and data types. On the other hand, Elasticsearch's big advantage over Solar is the ease of getting started. Field types are assigned automatically as your data is indexed into Elasticsearch. Unlike Solar, you don't need an index schema for your data. While not totally accurate, you can create manual mapping to ensure search relevance. Next, we talk about cluster, shard, and node management. Earlier, Solar didn't do anything on its own whenever a node joined or left a cluster. The autoscaling API introduced in Solar 7 solves this by letting you define cluster wide and collection specific policies that control shard placement. Solar also uses concurrent Apache Zookeeper instances to store configuration files and monitor the status of nodes in a cluster. Elasticsearch is more dynamic with node discovery and cluster management. Shards are automatically moved to accommodate new or deleted nodes. You can set tags to control shard placement and move them using APIs. On to the search functionality. This is where both have some commonalities. Since both Solar and Elastic use Lucene under the hood, they can deliver results in real time. The difference is in how they treat close to full text searches and features related to full text search. Both technologies allow for implementing a variety of search features, provide extensive support for language analysis, typo tolerance, synonyms, and highlighting. But implementing each of these features requires a learning curve. It's also not easy to predict their impact on the overall search relevance. When it comes to search and click analytics and using them to understand the business ROI of search, both Solar and Elastic don't provide an out-of-the-box support. You are left to implement this on your own by instrumenting your application code to record telemetry and then creating visualizations using business intelligence tools like Kibana or Grafana. The challenge that businesses and developers face with both Solar and Elasticsearch is that they are responsible for implementing, training and maintaining the search technology. This means they have to dedicate time and resources away from their core offering. Here is where AppPace.io comes in. Businesses can build fast and relevant search experiences using our no-code editor, JavaScript UI components, or declarative REST APIs. Search relevance settings like weights, typo tolerance, and synonyms can be set from a point-and-click control plane in real time. Configuring query rules to extend search relevance by promoting or hiding specific results, changing search behavior, and adding facets based on query, category, or a time frame. Visualize the impact of search with popular search terms, CTRs, conversions, and more. And the telemetry to record end user behavior is pre configured out of the box. Follow the link in the description where we compare the out of the box search experience you can build with AppBase.io to Solar or Elasticsearch. Get in touch with our team if you want to know how AppPace.io can be a good fit for your project.